Under the cool, crisp autumn skies at Rock Island Arsenal, Illinois, the Army Sustainment Command welcomed a new commanding general. Major General Eve Fontaine ended his two-year tenure as commanding general of ASC and handed over authority to Major General Patricia McQuistian. McQuistian comes from Kaiserslautern, Germany, where she served as commanding general of the 21st Theater Sustainment Command at U.S. Army Europe and 7th Army. We're both humbled and excited about this opportunity to serve the United States Command, and especially at this time of its history, and it is, as it has proved its worth in equipping and sustaining the Army and many of our sister services at home and abroad, in peace, and to wars. As it goes on that incredible history and moves out in a new and innovative direction to continue global operations today and shape Army support for the future. On hand for the formal transfer of the ASC flag was General Ann Dunwoody, Commanding General of the Army Materiel Command, ASC's parent command. The change of command ceremony is a time-honored tradition, ensuring a smooth transfer of authority from one leader to another. Today, I guess I pass the colors to this great organization and this installation to you with all hesitation and with a full understanding that is in great hands. You are taking over a mission that has seen and will continue to see many changes. It's been a superb opportunity for Kathy, Genevieve, and I to be part of a rich history of the Arsenal, the Army Sustainment Command, and the Quad City community. We will remain in the area as we fade away from military life. God bless you all. God bless this great nation. Everyone. For Major General Fontaine, the day was special for two reasons. Besides relinquishing command of ASC, he also ended a 36-year Army career. He will officially retire at the end of the year. I was just in Kuwait in Iraq and saw firsthand the impact that ASC is having on operations. The ASC teams are supporting the drawdown in Iraq, moving equipment back to the U.S., while sustaining our operations in Afghanistan. As you can see, I've given Eve all the easy missions. <laughs> in addition, Eve and AFC have left some of Army Material Command's most significant transformational initiatives. Now, losing a great commander during demanding times is usually very challenging. But I've known Pat the Christian for many years, and I've served with her many times. And I can tell you, once again, our Army has chosen wisely. She's a gifted leader, a strategic thinker, and she knows how to take care of soldiers, Army civilians, and their families. They have always been fully engaged with their local communities, no matter where they've been. Pat is a per perfect fit for Army Sustainment Command. She's done it all, a professional soldier, a great wife, a mom. Please join me in giving a big AMC welcome and ASC welcome to Pat the For ASC personnel, it was a chance to say farewell to one leader, welcoming a new commanding general, and continuing the important work of the Army Sustainment Command, serving America's soldiers around the world. Reporting for the Army Sustainment Command Public Affairs Office, I'm Greg Wilson.